giving all praises on the glory to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai Bahashim, Mekah Hagodash, the honors to the apostles and the elders, a great millstone and the sincere shalom to the Akinists out there pushing the sincerity and the truth and the sound doctrine. This is going to be a really, uh, really quick video. Now, no idea what I'm going to title this video yet. Um, um, you know, this is a video put up by um, this uh, YouTuber named uh, Mori. Um, kids are stealing cars and dying for the Kia Challenge, which I, I have, you know, definitely, I don't, I don't know who hasn't heard of it yet, you know, which I guess some people really haven't because, you know, not really big on social media, which is good. So that's that's pretty much the uh, direction I'm going to go into um, with this video. Is that social media is one of the best worst things that 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 happened to this society. Why do I say the best worst instead of just the worst? Well, look at what I'm doing now, right? So get ready, get ready to throw up a video through what? Social media. Social media gets a lot of information out. You can look things up through via social media, all right? But it's one of the worst things to ever happen because of stuff like this, right? But here's the thing, man. It goes deeper than social media. Who, do, who are the creators of social media? Right, who pushes the vibration of all this madness that goes on all around the world? Because you could just blame social media, sure, but but you got to blame the creator of social media, you got to blame the person who, who is who is pushing this vibration out there through the rap music, through the social media. The way the, the way our men and our women behave is absolutely ridiculous, and it's all due to the social, the social media. But this, this happened before the social media but social media just made it worse you know what i'm saying it, it just made it much much worse because what you see in a day um is really no different than really what happened in ancient time because everybody's doing what they did before it's just that social media and in, in today's age is just so much worse because you could do whatever it is you want to do and there's just so many outlets to just go off you, you see before in ancient time it really wasn't that that much to go off on but they still did it anyway but they didn't do it as openly as they doing it now you know what i'm saying so much so let's think things these these this today is so much worse it's utterly utterly ridiculous man it's utterly ridiculous but again you could blame social media hell you could even blame the parents because you got comments on there talking about the parents well, why are the parents the way they, they, they are? Right? Why are the parents behaving the way they are? Why 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 is the world in the position that it's in today? First off is because it little Eloy Yahweh by Shmiao Shah. That's first that's first off, right? And we're keeping it in order. Right? But then who did the Lord put the spirit on to to cause mischief? All around the world. And like I said, this is going to be a real quick video because I'm a little short on time. So I'm going to just, you know, run through it a little bit. Psalm chapter 1. It's so like Psalm chapter 12, verse 8. The wicked walk on every side. All right. When the vilest men are exalted. Who are the vilest men on this earth? Viler than a dirt. Right. You know, you know, who, 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 who is that talking about? Because you got people out there again, man. And I get sick and tired of hearing about hearing, hearing that shit got people out there well it's the powers that be it's the powers that be okay true but who are the powers that be you got to go into it what are you so afraid of what are you so afraid of just go ahead and say it man who are the powers that be Esau Edom man the wicked rats the small-headed cheap suits you know who I'm talking about about this about the small-headed 19 19 uh 48ers all right small-headed cheap suits you know what I'm saying? That's who I'm talking about, right? The ones that run this, that run the industry, right? The ones that do all this stuff, man. You know what I'm talking about, right? So the walk, the wicked walk on every side when the vilest men are exalted, and right now they are very exalted. I mean, hell, they run the world. So obviously, when vile men are exalted. You know what I'm saying? They they start doing vile things to the world. You know what I'm saying? When 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 vile creatures are exalted on high, 
that vibration starts being pushed out there. Then vile, then you start seeing vile things. You know what I'm saying? Now the wicked, now the wicked is walking on every side. Right? And for for anybody that don't know what the Kia challenge is, all right, I, I forgot to mention that. For anybody that don't know what this Kia challenge is, um, it's mainly it's mainly teenagers, and obviously of course boys, mainly boys because this social media is definitely designed to destroy destroy the men. All right, it's destroying the women as well. I mean, look at the way the women are, are behaving, but this is definitely designed to destroy the men. All right, men are the primary targets. All right. I mean, we catch help from Esau, we catch help from heathens, we catch help from our women. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, men, especially young men, all right, are the target. So, you got these, um, these kids, you know, stealing Kias, right? And then I guess they just go on a joyride and then, you know, they just... Some of them die, crash, you know, crash. Some of them run. Like in this video, they showed a clip of uh, of one of them running up on a sidewalk, like his GTA and shit. You know, it's a lot. It's a, it's too. It's yeah. That's exactly what it remind me of. It remind me of something you see on, on 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 Grand Theft Auto, man. You know, you see too much GTA, man. You know, but that's why. But that's why they. That's why they push that shit out there because they know some some people are going to get trapped up in there in that. Just like the music, just like the video games, just like the, the music industry, it's all designed to do that, man. It's all designed to do that. So you got these politicians talking about, see, video games, they 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 cause all this stuff. Well, it's not just video games, you know, and it, it, it's, it's not only that. In fact, that, that might just be the smallest part of it. What everybody has, everybody and their, even, even their great grandmother got a phone. And they got access to social media. Right? But it's all about the same though. You got movies. Yeah, you got people that are out here that watch movies. Why do you think women think they can just beat, beat up any man and shit? You got every woman out here is a damn tomboy now, man. Nobody, no, no woman out here is damn is fucking fucking feminine, man. Anytime you meet a woman, she always thinks she's equal to you, man, as a man. Got, a, got these damn tomboys out here, man. Why? Because of that social media. Why? Because of the movies. Because of the video games. Because of all that stuff, man. And I wouldn't know, because I play video games a lot, man. And that, and that shit is in there. And it makes me sick. But that's some that's some, some type of outlet that hey, you, you like movies, you like music. Uh, you know, you like, you like social media. Hey, man, do what you do. But do not be taken by that shit, man. All right, do not be taken by that. As soon as I said social media, Facebook messages pop up, right? Now, do not be taken by that, right? So that's what the kill challenge is, the challenge, so-called challenge, right? I mean, every everything's a damn challenge now, man. Whenever, whenever you have, whenever you have a challenge that challenges you to put a Tide pod, you know, in the soap pods, that you know. You know, them tied, you know, they, they, their little paw is tied. The soap tied. You know, whenever you have that challenging you, right? Trying to challenge you to put that shit in your mouth and it'll burst in your mouth. Soap. You got a problem. And any dumbass that did that, I don't feel sorry for them. There was one where you, I think you put something in an outlet and it's supposed to explode. And people died behind that, man. You don't want to know what that is? You want to know what this it this right here is? That's all part of the depopulation agenda because they already know some people are going to die behind that. This proves how easy it's going to be to enforce the MOTB, the mark of the beast. That proves how easy it's going to be, man. All right? Just pe you, you, as you see, people are literally willing to do anything for some form of entertainment. They're literally uh, willing to do anything, man, just for some form of entertainment, man. All right. Anyway, let's get the last scripture. All right. I only had two for this one. All right. Revelation chapter 13, verse 13. He doeth great wonders <clears throat> so that he make a fire come down from heaven and uh, um, 
come down from heaven on the earth in the sight of men. All right. So great wonders, right? It says, and he and deceiveth them that dwell on the earth by the means of those wonders which he had power to do in the sight of the beast. All right. So um those those uh those uh those miracles, those wonders, one of those things um is the internet. That's one of the greatest one of the greatest things, one of the greatest wonders that the Lord put uh put the spirit on Esau to produce. It's that goddamn internet. And you see where you see where it's leading us now, man. Right? But he also put them in the trick bag too, because you got a lot of information on the internet. We are on the internet. How, how are people able to how are we able to watch videos? How are we able to do videos? How are we able to push out videos for for the hopeful elect? All right. To watch. Uh, for the elect to watch, man. Through through the internet. And YouTube isn't the only outlet that we use. We use we you know Odyssey. You have Odyssey. You have certain other ones, man. Daily Motion, which I don't I don't really know how how that you know goes or whatever. But I I have heard it mentioned before that you know there's there's and then there's even another one I saw an ad on um, that I can't remember what it was called. It was it was a simple ad. Um, I was clicking on a random video, looking up some stuff, and. Uh, the ad, the ad had popped up and it was another website that you can upload videos on and you can pretty much say whatever it is you want to say they say you can voice your opinion or whatever right or what, whatever man in the kingdom man it ain't gonna be no it ain't gonna be a hundred thousand opinions okay that's that's off any damn way man all right so he deceived people by these wonders man that he's able to do and one of the greatest wonders that's gonna have us gonna Hit this place is what every 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 other bullshit ass Israelite camp has a problem with is is um the MOTB, the chip, the C hip. Right? They have a problem with that. But that's one of the greatest wonders that, that's gonna that's gonna be that's gonna be uh produced here, man. Right? It says saying to them, all right, now continuing on, it says saying to them that dwell on the earth, that they should make an image to the beast which had the womb by the sword and they live that's the ancient roman empire all right that's the image of the beast ancient roman empire okay uh, now now today's uh, image of the beast it, part of it is is this is this internet man all right this right this right here this right here is the image of the beast or at least, or at least part of it all right yeah great and i bet you every last one of their parents that's doing this Mainly the mothers, since since everybody, see here's the thing, man. Mothers don't want to take credit when when their sons is doing bad. They want to take credit when 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 their sons is basketball players, football players, going in the military or whatever, doing I guess doing something half decent, I guess, right? But when they out here squeegee kids, you know who get the blame? You know who get the credit for that? The the fathers, right? The fathers. That's who that's who get the credit. You know what I'm saying? That's 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 who get the credit. But 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 the mothers, they don't want to take credit for that. You know what they do? They hide in the back, they they blend in with the green screen, man. They just hide in the back and they and they get praised, they get praises for being a being a mother when they're not even mothers, man. Right? But again, you could blame you could blame them. Cause part of it does go to them, right? But sometimes there have been there have been instances where the mother or well the father or the mother, right, would do their very best to raise their child, and then they would then the child when they got old enough they would just have, have, you know kind of scurry off. Of the way that they was trained, and that's just the way the world is. That and that's why I said the ultimate, because that that does happen, and that's why I said the ultimate blame goes to Esau Edom, right? You got a daughter, and I say daughter because daughters are definitely the main ones that will that will go off on your ass, man. All right, and I'm talking about like scurry off of a way 
that you did that you didn't teach them. Like, what are you doing? Right? They go, you send them off to colleges and stuff like that. It's just like, man, that's it. You realize when they get to a certain age, they got their own mind. Now, again, um, you do your very best. It, it, it just that's just up to 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 the Most High, man. All right, but that's still no excuse for you not to not to try your very best, man. You know, to 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 raise your child. Scriptures tell you that to raise raise up, but because even even if they do go off of a way that you probably aren't really all that pleased with, they're still going to hold some of some of your ways. Some of, if you are righteous, they're still going to hold some of your righteous ways. You know, even in their even in their walk, they're going to make better decisions. You know what I'm saying? They're going to make even better decisions than if they weren't like trained at all. Like they're not going to be stupidly out of control. You know what I'm saying? So that still has a factor. But due to us being in this society, it is it'll never be a hundred percent, man. It'll never be a hundred percent. We got, we got to get to the kingdom, man. And that's why we got to get out of here, right? Because the Lord is going to constantly remind us that. You are still in slavery, man. You are still in captivity. This ain't your rest. Don't don't relax. Right? So anyway, that's pretty much all I got on this. Giving all praise on the glory to you. How will I shimmy how will shine shalom?